Come on, password. If you wear a mask and you have an iPhone with Face ID, you know this standoff very well. Except that might change for you soon. A new update to the iPhone iOS 14.5 is going to have a special Face ID unlock trick. You just need one of these. Yep, if you're wearing an Apple Watch, your iPhone can unlock without seeing your full face. How does it work? If your watch is unlocked on your wrist and your iPhone is nearby but can't read your full face, your watch will buzz and Face ID will unlock. And you're in. It's pretty awesome. Here's what's happening behind the scenes. Face ID tries to identify you as usual. If it can't see your nose and mouth, it looks for your unlocked watch to confirm it's you. There's no actual scanning of your eyes or what's still visible of your face. See, even with my eyes closed, it lets me in. How well does it work? Pretty darn well, other than the fact that you need to have an Apple Watch, which starts at $200. Talk about being masked in by Apple. Let's do some speed tests. Mask-free Face ID, 0.8 seconds. Face ID with a mask and the watch feature enabled, 1.4 seconds. And a fingerprint sensor on the iPhone SE, 0.7 seconds. Getting in with a six-digit passcode, a year. Okay, fine, three seconds. Worried about security and someone getting into your phone if they have your watch? Yeah, it can be done. But it's not likely. Each time you put on your watch, you turn on this whole auto unlock feature on your iPhone by entering your iPhone passcode. If someone has that, they won't need your watch anyway. A bigger fear is someone like masked man Kenny here, grabbing your phone and unlocking it just by being close to the unlocked watch on your wrist. What are you gonna do with my phone? Tweet. Access to her Venmo. Sweet. But Apple has some protection against this. You can tap here to quickly lock the phone from your wrist. In my tests, the iPhone and the watch have to be within 10 feet of each other. This is beta software, so this and other things may change. Plus, this Apple Watch shortcut is only good for unlocking your iPhone. If you're wearing a mask while trying to buy something using Apple Pay, the App Store, or iTunes, the phone will still require your password. So how do you get it? Your iPhone needs to be running iOS 14.5, and your Apple Watch needs to be running watchOS 7.4. Plus, you have to turn it on by going into Settings, Face ID and Passcode, and turning on Unlock with Apple Watch. Right now, those operating systems are in beta, and if you don't want to wait until the final release this spring, you can sign up for Apple's beta program now. Anyone can do this, but it's unfinished software, so there can be bugs or battery drain. So far, so good for me, but download at your own risk. Either way, this software update cannot come soon enough.